Hello everybody, my name is Rolak. Welcome back to Hi-Fi Rush. In the last episode, we managed to quote-unquote accomplish Chai's plan into infiltrating the Vandalay Tower by launching ourselves directly into it via cannon. Didn't really get to where we need to be, but hey, we're in the building and Roquefort's office is literally right over there, so we're not too far off of it. And in today's episode, we're going to be availing through this atrium, hopefully getting to Roquefort's office. No problem whatsoever. First off... Atrium statue mail to Vandalay all from Kale. Kale statue. I, w I want to thank all those in involved in the construction of the oversized version of my likeness. I don't think that this feat can be overstated. While this can be seen as self-centered and egomaniacal, I disagree. It is a standing monument to what one person can achieve. Personally, I feel it's subtle, if anything. Yep. As a self-made man, describing my family lineage, inherited wealth, and the fact that I started at the top and worked my way sideways to get to this position, I hope this piece is a reminder that you, yes you, can one day be the head of the world's largest corporation. Yeah, subtle. Would not use the word subtle, but um... Cool if you do it, dude! I mean, what do I know? You're the leader of a giant conglomerate corporation that has complete dominion over the world, it seems. Again, what do I know? I'm just a consumer. Oh yeah, graffiti. Almost missed this. <laughs> Good old wrench. There are four graffitis in this level, and I think these are the last... Well, aside from, you know, the ones that we've missed, due to several reasons, um, the last ones that we can collect in the level just normally. Yeah, come on. There we go. This is a life gauge piece. There's two more, and I think with those two more, we'll get the last life gauge that we'll need. I think. Pretty sure they are. Another door. Save that for later. Guys, if I think we're done up there anyway. All right, let's go. Just brush it off. You're almost there. Well, so much for unhindered progress, but... I mean, what can we really expect at this point? Hey, fellas! Buddy, you need to fuck right off! No, not them, Peppermint! What are you aiming at? Buddy! No! There we go. You! Okay. You want a Hibiki? Is that what you want? Because that's what you're getting. <laughs> hey, buddy. How's it going? Hopefully this prolongs the stun. And it doesn't. Come on. There we go. Bop, beep, bop, bop, bop. And dead. Better be a good enough score. Damn right. Not getting any more fucking A ranks at this point. Sick of them. Uh, we'll just. How can we not get rid of this one? No, we can't. <laughs> it's only the ones that are talking that we can get rid of. Not the ones that are just showing our faces everywhere. <laughs> One fight right after another. And you really don't want us to get it anywhere. Okay. Come on. You're giving me two enemies to fight. They take less than 30 seconds to take care of. And you expect me to get higher than that amount of points in that small a lot of amount of time? Come on, man. You join this 808? All units in the atrium, do whatever you need to do. Oh, I'll explain 
Like, what does this game want from me? Keep going, child. First, I was gonna do that anyway. Second, I can make my own decisions, Corsica. I am an adult. Says a guy who shot himself out of a cannon. Hey, it works. Kinda. What does the game want me to do? Does it want me to perform perfectly? To, to perform jam combos when there was literally no chance of me building up enough gauge to get there? You found me, kid. Taking a break. Taking my eyes off the prize. So what now? You gonna bust me? This is the wanted defect. Mutually assured destruction. He turns us in, he'll spill the beans on our break. I believe there is a reward. I won't do it. I don't stab someone in the back. Especially this kid. He knows what he's doing. So go on, run off. Try to escape this cruel world. It'll only pull you back in. Oh. Thanks. Okay. Again, still not really getting your vibe here, but not really one to complain. Really don't know whose side he's on. I guess he's morally gray, but even then, that's... Okay, how can I work for... Oh my god! God, that was the worst one yet. Oh my god. Hey, hey vlog. Budget challenge mail from Oakford at Vandalay. Apply budget challenge. I'd like to thank every section of this company for participating with the budget challenge. While it was difficult to shave off unnecessary costs, the result have allowed us to have most of our profitable quarters yet and increase bonuses for all our top employees. I'd personally like to give the finance section a special thanks for submitting the idea of removing the left arms and legs from development programmers to cut costs. A brilliant move. Yeah, but how effective is that? Is that going to be... Wouldn't that, wouldn't that in long term gather less profits than normal? Because you're kind of hindering the progress of the workers and thus you won't be making as much money because they won't work won't be as done as that. I don't know. Again, I'm not a businessman. I don't do number crunching or whatever it is Roqueford does. I'm just offering my two bit of advice. But, like, come on, man. If I'm able to figure this out, then I feel like a finance director should be able to figure it out better than I can. It can't be that difficult. It's just money. You just allocate some amount of money to... Mac. Thank you. Okay. Jeez. No, you didn't do anything wrong. I just need to destroy you. Don't worry about it. Are we actually going to be able to get a full health tank at some point? Maybe if they give us more health crates? Like, seriously, where is everything? There. Hey, look at that. Health tank. Part number two. All right. Hoodie pre-order mail. Commander of hoodie, hoodie pre-orders for employees. Due to the amount of commotion regarding the escape defect and Kale's assurance that the situation will be handled with finality, uh, we've begun accepting pre-orders for the humorously themed I Survived the Project Armstrong Defect Fiasco hoodies. These will be available in a white Nimbus colorway with the text in a font called Tangolian Rail. They will be individually numbered for any surviving employees. Please register your size in the link below. Security note unauthorized link automatically removed. <laughs> Great. So that was uh, worthless. <laughs> And I feel like these things are just dropping less and less. I don't know. It certainly seems like it. You're so close to getting another to a health tank up. I just want to show off what it looks like when it's complete. Um, yeah, I think we're good to go forward. Oh, yep, there we go. Not a fight zone. Hey, are we actually going to be getting it? There we go. Now it's folded up. Now when we actually get to drop our health down, it will restore us to full. 
We got another spray of Roquefort there. Vandalay Handbook. No, Vandalay Employee Handbook. Here you will find the simple steps to becoming the most powerful company in the world. Step one, do everything better than everyone, anyone else and make more money. Thank you all for reading this Employee Handbook. All 150,788 subset conditions to this step are included in mandatory online tutorials. All employees will have one week to complete the courses. Great. That's always fun to do. Here we go. I think we're almost actually done with this level. This isn't... Despite our... Interesting opening, this isn't a super long level. Why well, I did not... What? I, what happened? I didn't call in Corsica for a jam combo. I called her in to stun them. What? I am very confused. Because I very much pressed a button, a regular X or Y button to do the B hit. And then it... What? acceptable or not for a rank, but I'm not really going to complain. I mean, I really shouldn't be complaining. I really don't need to be complaining, because, like, nothing bad is actually happening, but, yeah. Mac, buddy, come on. And that gets the job done. Is there anything on Statue Kale? I don't think there is. Oh, that's a, oh, that's a long drop. <laughs> there is something down here, however. Some health items, which is very nice, as well as a reverb core piece. And that's two, so I just need two more. Okay, and that's everything down here. Yes, yes. Up we go. And yeah, we're already at the end of the level. Wow. Despite this being, you know, one of the last two levels, it's not really a long level when you really look into it. It's probably just the immense amount of the hype that goes on to the intro for this level that just really gets it going. And then you realize, oh yeah, this isn't that long of a level after all. Another circuit. And a vlog. Roquefort meeting prep. Open note. HR says I should keep the ball and write down my tasks and achievements to stay motivated. Well, this new budget may be a bit of an increase, but I see it as a good move in public's eye. Can't imagine Roquefort disagreeing with me. He seems like a very reasonable man. I feel as confident as ever. Yeah, I wouldn't put it past you. <laughs> I wouldn't count on that um, reasonable. Yeah, there's nothing else for me to buy. I really don't need anything else. This is new. Pick it up. Hello? You sure made an entrance, lad. If you've come for me, I'd walk away. You trying to make a deal? Come on, man. You think I'll let you spoil our plan? Leave profits on the table? This isn't about money. It always is. You get in our way, you'll see red. Oh, 
he's just letting us in? This guy looks like a total pushover. I don't know, Chai. Rotfart had a bad rep around the office. Something about a wolf in sheep's clothes? Keep that confidence in check, Chai. Trapaski, now. Oh yeah, sure, take it. <laughs> what do you think I am, an idiot? Well, it was worth asking. Ugh, you're making me angry. I was on my deathbed when Kale saved me. I was smart, but weak. He fixed that. Really? Why do you want to be less smart? This is a waste of time, and you know what time is? Money! And I am not gonna waste any more of that. I'm gonna waste you. Well, tell me how it feels to underestimate someone. <sighs> That wolf thing was not an expression! You wanna get the tail? You gotta get through me. Alright, Rogue Fert. Wolf of Wall Street, Wolf in Sheep's Closing, whatever you wanna call him. He's very hard hitting, and he, his attacks are just very easy to hit, translate. Sometimes. As it currently stands, he's just got some standard swipe attacks. Jump attack that will send off two shock waves, so be sure to parry both of them. And a projectile beam attack. Currently, Sam, there's not much else to do much in the battle than just get close to him and just hit him. Luckily, he's a rather big target. And for this phase, we'll knock him right back into his human form, and we just got to go ahead and wail on him for a little bit. For a while, he put on a barrier. Just get Peppermint to blow it off. After a while, he'll bring out a Z-Shield, wait for him to stop running, then throw him back in. Because chances are you'll just not be able to hit him when he's running. Wait for him to stop. Go in. There we go. You're only making me angry. Is that even possible? Let's take this someplace a bit more secure, so we don't disturb the neighbors. Nothing really has changed for this phase just yet. Except for that dash attack, I'm pretty sure that's the only addition he gets in this phase. Oh, and this. Watch out, Chai! Call me in. Let me help. Come on, you don't scare. So we'll just have to do a little quick time event. Nothing too difficult to do. Now I'll stun him for a little bit. No 
some particle effects slowing down again. That's really weird. And a quick, very, very quick flurry attack. Be sure to just spam B when you're doing, when you're getting hit by that. There we go. Now for his human phase, it's going to be a little bit different. Instead of putting up a barrier and a shield, he's just going to be running away and hiding behind lasers. You can still hit him with Peppermint, but the main thing you want to do is look for an opening in the lasers. Dodge out the ones that are coming at you, and there you go. Look for the opening, get him in between the openings, and yeah. We'll pass through the openings and then just start wailing on him. There we go. Victra, the profit would leave on the table. The numbers are in, and you are out. Well, that makes no sense, you idiot. Put my stock in the future, but not yours, kid. Now, this is the phase where it starts to get a lot different. Ow! Fuck me! Alright, time for a pick me up. If he'll do his new move, eventually, he'll, like, dive down, I think. There we go. So he dives down. Doing some dash attacks. Now, when he jumps up, you want to stand near this fist because he'll stun himself. Something I did not realize until fairly recently that you can do. Pretty sure that's the only new move he's got. Aside from that, it's pretty much just the same thing over and over again. There we go. This is our chance, Jai. Together, we can go up against it. <laughs> the funny thing is, you think you can win. <laughs> but as long as you keep making me mad, I'm not going anywhere. <sighs> Time to cash my check by taking you out! <laughs> Order three earnings delivered. Please watch out for falling profits. Huh. Uh, we're here. Oh, you should have seen it. What a fight. We were spectating through the door. Lady Corsica suggested to let you handle it. Uh, Cinnamon, we don't always have to repeat everything we hear. Last on the list? Kale. Are you ready for this, Peppermint? I am. It ends here. Good score all around. Not bad at all. Do we get a break? Gale is plotting, and much smarter than us, especially Mr. Chai. We should be ready. I should be confident, but I'm worried. 
Hey, everyone. Vibe check. Macaron, I need you to be positive for this one. Peppermints, it'll be hard, but don't let emotion get in the way. Corsica, I can count on you to be level-headed about this. Cinnamon, keep doing whatever you're doing. You know, I like this new chai. He's quite come around, hasn't he? So, let's prep everyone. Okay, we do get a break. Okay. So. Wait, he's got giant prints everywhere. Well. Okay, so I think that's going to do it for this episode. Pretty good. I managed to get the second half of the level done. All right. Next time on Hi-Fi Rush, we, after briefing with the team real quick, Cinnamon just glitch. What is it? Cinnamon? Cinnamon, buddy, what's going on over there? Buddy? <laughs> you good? Cinnamon? <laughs> what's going on, man? <laughs> I saw I saw that. It definitely popped up on the video. What's going on with him? Okay. Let's, we'll worry about that later. Now he's doing it again. Next time on Hi-Fi Rush, we're gonna, after consoling with the team, we're going to be heading up to confront Kale once and for all. See you guys next time.